What's happening, y'all? It's Adventure Bro number two. We're here in Naples, Florida, and we've already got our first adventure. We just arrived last night, slept in, but we're up early and ready to go. Check this out. So we've got a baby rabbit that's somehow stuck in the pool that we're in. We'll figure out how to get him out. Stay tuned. I mean, he's not gonna go out. He knows that. Well, I don't know if he Look, gets there's a frog right there. Too. If he gets scared, he might try to swim. I wonder, or here, if you do that, I can grab a towel and grab him. We'll set it up. So Jen's gonna go grab a towel. I don't even know how this guy got in here. You only find content like this on the Adventure Bro Show. So stay tuned, we're about to grab him. It's not gonna bite you. <laughs> Let's get him on camera and release him. So Jen's got her. It's a little baby rabbit. Say hello. Now let's go ahead and release him. Did it outside? Like out there? Yeah. Should be good. Still don't go in the house. Oh, I get shaky. <laughs> you can't go back that way. Did it go out that way? No. It's just I see it. sure he's gonna hide out guys Just say goodbye oh well, we thought we were going to the beach it's gonna stop in a minute it's this tiger tail beach on Marco Island in Naples, Florida. big fish jumping. I don't know if that's mullet jumping like that or or what, but you put a line in the water, you might do some damage. And they're like right by the shore. I mean, you can see them like when they jump. Oh, there's some amazing fish in there. Look at that. <laughs> oh, I'm going crazy. <laughs> you can see all of the, the, the yes. Yeah. That's hey, that's Julia. bait fish getting chased by something. Do you think if we go walk up there, we can see them? Since they're so close. Maybe, but it's kind of hard. We have like a much higher vantage point. Well, I'm just saying, like if they come close to the shore. Yeah. Gotta love that smell. I know. Whoa, that was There's one right there. Mm -hmm. Yes. Oh, we scared that. I think we probably just scared all the fish too. Or the birds kind of scared them. I feel like it's like 
yo. Oh my God. Did you see it? What is it? It's really murky. Oh, I just want to throw my line in there. This is like top water heaven. Wow. Yep, we're coming back. Yeah, it's a good place for tomorrow. All right, y'all. We saw a lot. We're really excited for tomorrow. Kind of scared because I don't know if we're actually going to catch anything. But there's redfish in there. There's snook in there. There's even Spanish mackerel supposedly in there. So we'll see what we do. All right, y'all, we're here back at Tiger Tail Beach in Marco Island. And we're gonna put Million on some fish, Jen on some fish, and hopefully myself on some fish. Stay tuned. zoom in but I'll walk over there and show us it's pooping a little bit stop you're gonna fling it you see the teeth oh, <laughs> oh we have the camera right here there's a little crab next to you in front of you where right in front of you Dante this not a crab. across from that you see it oh, oh, that little right. tiny yeah thing. Jen, what did you feel when you when you caught it? Um, like it just. Woo! <laughs> it's fine. It's okay. Um, I don't know. It's just kind of like like I don't know how to describe it. You feel it. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Nice. Hold it tight. <laughs> Do I have to press anything? No, you're good. I don't, I don't honestly don't even think you're recording, to be honest with you. Can but you just you toss it back? Think. Yeah. No, nah. you, you are recording. See it so more? Boom goes the dynamite. We've got our first fish in. Let's go. We know they're here now. Uh, yeah, it's just kind of like, it like kind of feels like nibble nibble and then it like pulls. Okay. And you want to wait, like, it's hard to not pull. Like, I always pull too early mm -hmm. when they first start nibbling, and then you don't get a fish, and they just get your shrimp. Damn. But okay. It's, like, it's hard to wait, but when you wait, you <laughs> You said what part is sharp? This? Yeah, I see, basically. And the bottom, too. Like, the bottom back. Dorsal or whatever. I don't know. I don't you can try to take it out. So grab it. From so where? The easiest way to grab these. It's like this. You see how this? You see how these go this way? Yeah. But they lay down when they go this okay. way. Okay. So it's always. I'm always scared to hurt to... them, but you gotta just do it. Wow. And usually you want to handle them with two hands. And you want. I... And you really want to like. You see how hard I'm squeezing? You see the? Yeah. yeah. You gotta squeeze them. Oh, you bleed. That's fine. But here, hold it. Take this out? Yep. You got all your hair. Push. Dang. So, hold on. You always want to look and see where that hook is while you're taking it out. So you see how it's like, that hook has a, a real circle to it. So, and 
if you need to, and it's like, fuck, yeah. Uh, Go ahead, it's about to come out. Wow. Man, like that guy we saw throwing back in those catfish. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> Man, what did you do to my fish? Did we Don't kill them, bro? Stunned, no, so we didn't. Yeah, they get stunned. There it goes. Um, we saw this one. Oh, the ear is like, thank you. Like, oh, <laughs> Damn, oh, this is. Cute. Um. Like, we saw some guys, like the catfish, uh -huh. are annoying to catch, and I think people get irritated at catching them. So this guy was like slamming them <laughs> in the water. Holy, holy fuck. Damn. I'm just trying to get that feel of like what oh, it yeah. feels. That thing is beautiful. All right, y'all, it's our last day, or at least last day of adventures here. We start our drive back tomorrow morning, and that should be a lot of fun. We're gonna stop in New Orleans, finish out the drive on Sunday, but check this big grasshopper out. Beautiful thing. Stay tuned and enjoy this. We're gonna go ahead and take off again, everybody. Right, they're covered with mud, so I think it's camouflage. Alligators are, are not as dumb as what people think, folks. He knows that he's underneath the water and he's kind of camouflaged. Sometimes you'll even see them, or I do, they'll, they'll move forward a little bit, they'll swing their tail, and the mud cloud will go around them and they'll just sit in the middle of the mud cloud where the rest of the water is undisturbed. You know? Too much energy. Come, that Madara guy possesses Renegon eyes! What exactly did you do to this body? Like I mentioned to you before, I made you even better than at the peak of your power. You bastard. Do not misunderstand it. This is not power of your creation! You're fine. I promise. Jillian, I borrowed your. Uh, there's dolphins literally right there. Jen. Oh my god. There's dolphins right there. Where? <laughs> it's right here. I see it. I don't think. Is it a dolphin or a shark? <laughs> That's a stingray, a giant stingray. It's not a dolphin. It wasn't a dolphin. <laughs> it's a spotted stingray. Yeah. Just kidding. <laughs> you did. You just asked. You just asked. I think it's still right there. They were just over there not too long ago. I think there's so many dolphins right here today. It's coming back, yeah. The stingray? Yeah, I see it. It's oh, over there. It's right there. 
<laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> Yeah, I was like, it's dolphin. I was like, I don't think that's a dolphin. What just happened?